The following opinions are solely those of BoatTest.com and its test captain. Hi, I'm Captain Steve Gilchrist for BoatTest.com. Today we're going to review and test the Rabalo R160. The new 2016 Rabalo R160's features start with the window sticker. For under $20,000 you get a top of the line Rabalo center console with engine and trailer, not to mention Rabalo's 10 year warranty. This boat is geared towards the first time boat buyer or angler looking for a 16 foot fishing machine. Don't let the size fool you, Rabalo used the same Kevlar reinforced hull, the same stainless steel hardware and attention to detail found on Rabalo's larger models. Let's start our look at the R160 at the bow. The first thing you'll notice is the diamond lustre non-skid surfaces throughout the boat. The bow is no exception. Rabalo knew every inch of this boat could end up being stepped on by fishermen or water sports enthusiasts. Of course you'll find stainless grab handles up front. Rubalo wanted to create a functional casting deck at the bow, so they moved the navigation lights to the side of the center console and installed the Rubalo logoed pop-up cleat up front, leaving a clean area for the anglers. The storage compartment in the bow is insulated and has an overboard drain. It can be used for drinks or to keep the day's catch fresh. Still in the bow area and forward of the center console, you'll find the second bow cooler with optional cooler cushion. Also notice the six vertical rod holders. Our test boat was fitted with the optional 16-gallon live well system, further expanding its fishing capabilities. The forward-facing center console backrest hides a large storage compartment where Robalo keeps the aft navigation light and or any other items you might want to keep dry. We measured 22 inches of cockpit depth and 8 inch wide side cap rails. The aft jump seats with folding backrest quickly convert the area into a casting platform. There is a fiberglass transom entry step on the starboard side. You can also see Rabalo's extended V-plane running surface that extends past the engine. More on that later. Under the starboard jump seat is the battery switch and marine battery. The port side features a storage for a 5-gallon bucket. Another feature is the non-skid cover over the gas tank. Also notice the Rabalo branded backing plate for the engine mount. Moving on to the helm seat, it has a reversible backrest and underneath is the third integrated cooler on board holding up to 70 quarts. It's also been designed to hold another two 5 gallon buckets. The helm features an acrylic windshield with an aluminum frame to add strength, fit and finish. The top of the console includes two indented non-skid self-draining spots for cell phones. Just below is plenty of space to add a variety of optional electronics and the tilting steering wheel makes it easy to run this boat seated or standing. The Rabalo 160 has plenty of legroom at the helm station. A nice safety feature is how easy the kill switch attaches to the operator. The R160 comes standard with a 60 horsepower Yamaha engine. Our test boat had the optional 70 horsepower engine and 90 horsepower is another option. Two big contributing factors to this boat's performance are Rabalo's Hydralift multi-angle hull design and their extended V-plane running surface. Our test boat was fitted with the four-stroke Yamaha 70 horsepower outboard. Our test boat had a beam of 7 foot and weighed in at 1,674 pounds. We achieved plane in 6 seconds flat, passed through 20 miles an hour in 8.7 seconds, 30 miles an hour came in 15.2 seconds. Our top speed was at 6,100 RPM and 35.1 miles per hour, burning 6.2 gallons per hour giving us a range of 62 statute miles with the standard 12 gallon fuel tank. There is an 18 gallon option if you're interested in extending your range or time on the water. Our best cruise came at 25 miles per hour turning 4,500 RPM, which gave us a range of 83 statute miles, again with the standard tank. If getting into shallow fishing areas is a concern, the 10 inch draft will come in handy. At this price point and level of features, the Robalo R160 represents a good value as your first new boat. It was designed with fishing in mind but will easily serve double duty as a light water sports boat for the whole family. And that concludes our look at the Robalo R160. I'm Captain Steve Gilchrist for BoatTest.com.